In this tutorial, we will show you how easy it is to install a second module into Symfony I.O., giving you great flexibility for just about any I.O. configuration. It is absolutely necessary to follow these steps before removing or installing modules. Use a Phillips screwdriver to remove the 11 screws holding the cover on. If you've installed the rack ears, you will need to remove those as well. Slide the cover off. The front lip may catch as you're sliding the cover off. Pull gently on the sides and then pull back and up slightly. Remove the two screws holding the center support in place and remove it. Remove the blank panel that is in the second slot. Make sure to save these two screws as you will need them to secure the new I.O. module later. Nine screws hold in the I.O. module that have already been installed. One by one, replace the nine screws with the provided aluminum standoffs. Place the I.O. module and align it so that you can reinstall the nine screws you just removed. Don't tighten them all the way at this time. Install the two screws on the back panel that you removed earlier. Now tighten the nine screws. Connect the provided ribbon cable to the secondary I.O. port on the main board and the other end of the ribbon cable to the new I.O. module. Reconnect the center support bar. Slide the cover back into place and secure with the 11 screws you removed earlier. The six screws on the bottom are flat and should mount flush. The five on the back have rounded heads and will not be flush. Your new I.O. module is now installed and ready to use.